Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem of simplify cube root of square root of 5 minus 2. Now, solution. From this, our problem, which is cube root of square root of 5 minus 2, square root of 5 is greater than 2. So, the cube root of square root of 5 minus 2 the domain it should be greater than 0. Then in the next step, suppose we let this as x. So it will be suppose x is equal to cube root of square root of 5 minus 2. Then to remove this cube root, we will power by 3 in both sides. So it will be x power of 3 is equal to, here we'll power by 3, power of 3 will cancel this cube root so it will be this here which is square root of 5 minus 2 and also y is equal to cube root of square root of 5 here we have minus y to be plus 2 then when we power by 3 in both sides it will be y power of 3 is equal to this cube root will cancel this the power of 3 so it will be equal to this which is square root of 5 plus 2 then in the next step we'll take this x power 3 minus y power 3 so here it will be x e power 3 minus y power 3 is equal to this minus this so it will be bracket square root of 5 minus 2 bracket minus this bracket square root of 5 plus 2 bracket so it will be x power 3 minus y power 3 is equal to here I'll open the bracket so it will be square root of 5 minus 2 we open the bracket by negative so it will be minus square root of 5 here it will be minus 2 so this square root of 5 minus square root of 5 will cancel then it will be x power 3 minus y power 3 is equal to minus 2 minus 2 it will be minus 4 so let's call this equation 1 then in the next step we'll take x times y so x times y here it will be x y is equal to x is this times this so so it will be cube root of square root of 5 minus 2 then here bracket times this here which is I mean cube root of 5 plus this here plus 2 bracket then it will be x y is equal to from here cube root times cube root so it will be common cube root so here common cube root of this times this under cube root so this here which is square root of 5 minus 2 bracket bracket times this cube root of 5 plus 2 bracket then it will be x y is equal to cube root of this times this is in the form of a perfect square so from the perfect square rule which is a minus b bracket times a plus b bracket is equal to a square minus b square so a square it will be square root of 5 square so here square root of 5 bracket square minus b square it will be this 2 square then it will be x y is equal to cube root of this we we'll cancel this so it will be 5 minus 2 squares 4 so 5 minus 4 is 1 so it will be x y is equal to cube root of 1 it is 1 so this here we'll call equation 2 then we'll solve equation 1 with equation 2 so from equation 1 which is x e power 3 minus y power 3 is equal to this which is negative 4 and equation 2 is x e y is equal to 1 then from equation 1 x e power 3 minus y power 3 this here is in the form of a perfect cube so this here will apply the rule which is a power 3 minus b power 3 is equal to a minus b bracket bracket 
a square plus a b plus b square bracket so a minus b it will be x minus y so here x minus y bracket then times a square it will be x square then plus a b to be plus x y then plus b square to be y square bracket is equal to this minus 4 then in the next step from here x square plus y square we make to have relation with x minus y so from the x minus y bracket square the square of this here it is equal to x square minus 2xy plus y square now this x square plus y square it is this x square plus y square so this here we take to this side so we start by this here x square plus y square is equal to this x minus y bracket square minus 2xy we take to this side to be plus 2xy then from here it will be x minus y bracket bracket here x square plus y square will substitute this so it will be x minus y bracket square then plus 2xy then plus this xy bracket is equal to this minus 4 then from here it will be x minus y bracket bracket x minus y bracket square plus 2xy plus xy is 3xy bracket is equal to minus 4 then in the next step here xy xy is from equation 2 xy is equal to 1 so here we we'll substitute 1 so it will be 3 times 1 is 3 then it will be x minus y bracket bracket x minus y bracket square plus 3 times 1 is 3 bracket is equal to minus 4 then x minus y will take inside the bracket so x minus y times x minus y bracket square it will be x minus y bracket power of 3 plus x minus y times 3 is 3 bracket x minus y bracket is equal to minus 4 then in the next step from here we'll let so we'll let u is equal to x minus y then our equation will be u power 3 plus 3 u is equal to minus 4 then from here we'll take minus 4 to this side so it will be u power 3 plus 3y minus 4 take this side to be plus 4 is equal to 0 then from this cubic equation it can be solved by grouping and factorization here we have u power 3 plus 3u and from here 4 4 is same as 1 plus 3 so it will be u power 3 plus 3u then plus 4 it is 1 plus 3 is equal to 0 then it will be u power 3 here 1 we make 12 power 3 so 1 is same as plus 1 power 3 then plus this plus this so plus 3u plus 3 is equal to 0 then from here u u power 3 plus 1 this part here is in the form of a power 3 plus b power 3 which is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket so to apply this form a plus b it will be u plus 1 so here u plus 1 bracket bracket a square it will be u square then minus a b it will be u times 1 is u plus b square it will be 1 square which is 1 then plus from this part here 3u plus 3 we we'll take 3 out of bracket so 3u divided by 3 is u plus 3 divided by 3 is 1, bracket is equal to 0. Then from here, u plus 1 is common. So we'll take u plus 1, bracket out of bracket. Then this here, divide by u plus 1, it is this. So it will be u square minus u plus 1. Then plus, 
this divided by u plus 1 it is 3 so it will be plus 3 bracket is equal to 0 then it will be u plus 1 bracket bracket u square minus u plus 1 plus 3 is 4 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution u plus 1 is equal to 0 and this second solution u square minus u plus 4 is equal to 0 then from this solution we take 1 to this side so it will be u is equal to negative 1 and here this quadratic equation we check if it will give a real solution so to check this we'll use the determinant formula is equal to b square minus 4ac so it will be determinant is equal to b square coefficient of u is negative 1 so it will be negative 1 bracket square minus 4 times a is 1 coefficient of u square which is 1 times c is 4 so to be determinant is equal to negative 1 square is positive 1 minus 4 times 1 times 4 it will be minus 16 so here it will be determinant is equal to 1 minus 16 is minus 15 whereas this is less than 0 so from here if it is less than 0 no real roots so this solution here will be rejected then we could also solve from this first solution u is equal to negative 1 but before we let that u u it is this here u is x minus y so from u which is x minus y is equal to this negative 1 then we compare with the, this equation 2 here xy is equal to 1 equation 2 this here so from x y is equal to 1 so we we'll solve this here now here we make y the subject from this first equation so we'll take y to negative y to this side to be positive y we'll take negative 1 to this side to be positive 1 so it will be y is equal to x plus 1 then this y will substitute here into the second equation so it will be x times y which is this x plus 1 bracket is equal to this 1 so here x times x is x square plus x times 1 is x is equal to 1 then we take 1 to this side to be x square plus x 1 we take this side to be minus 1 is equal to 0 then from this quadratic equation to find the values of x because we are supposed to find the values of x here before we let this this as x so we find the values of x so from quadratic formula which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a so it will be x is equal to negative b coefficient of x is 1 so times b it will be negative 1 plus or minus square root of b square it will be 1 square minus 4 times a a is 1 times c c is negative 1 then over 2 times a a is 1 so it will be x is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 1 square 1 square is 1 negative 4 times 1 times negative 1 is positive 4 then over this times this is 2 so it will be x is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 1 plus 4 is 5 over 2 now from here we have two values of x because of plus or minus so it will be the first value of x negative 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 so x is equal to negative 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 and the other solution is negative 1 minus square root of 5 over 2 so x is equal to negative 1 minus square root of 5 over 2 now into here negative 1 square root of 5 minus 1 over 2 this here the value of x here it is greater than 0 and here minus 1 minus square root of 5 over 2 this value here 
it is less than 0 but not the domain domain for this here domain it is greater than 0 so if this is greater than 0 this is less than 0 so this here it is not corresponding to the domain so this here will be rejected so from before we let x is equal to cube root of square root of 5 minus 2 and x it is this so it will be this here so the simplified form of i mean cube root of square root of 5 minus 2 is equal to the simplified form it is equal to this minus 1 plus square root of 5 it will be square root of 5 minus 1 then over this 2 so this here is the simplified form of this our uh, problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye